Good morning, welcome to day seven. Uh, if you've made it this far, I wanna congratulate you. You're doing great. Uh, just wanted to do a little bit of uh, bringing it together uh, at the end of seven days and just kind of a reminder about fasting. Fasting isn't as much about how you show, it's about how you grow. And what we mean by that is when Jesus uh, told people about fasting, he instructed them not to change their, to, excuse me, not to change their appearance, not to tell everybody that they were doing that. So in our world, it looks like this. Uh, we don't need to be out there going, hey, I'm doing fasting on, uh, with the church and everything and put that on social media and everybody to go, hey, that's great, good for you, what a spiritual person you are. If we're doing that, we're kind of missing the point. What we really need to do is focus on the fact that we are putting ourselves in a position to hear from God. We talked a lot this first week about humility and that really needs to be kind of the baseline that we need to operate in. And so as we do this and we realize that fasting is something that God ordained and God put uh, in the Bible for us to learn to do because he wants us to see the breakthrough and he knows that we're gonna have to take time away from some of the things that we love, some of the things that kind of call for our attention and focus on him. And he knows all the things that we have to do. He's not a slave driver, he's not uh, difficult, but he also knows that until we slow down, we're not gonna get in that place where we're hearing from him. I like what one preacher said. He said, God's not putting on any 99 cent sales. He's not uh, making any deals. The same thing that it took the people in the Bible to hear from God is, gonna, is what it's gonna take from us. We're not gonna get God to operate on our schedule where we just kind of blow through the drive through and say, hey, I needed this answer to prayer. I'm kind of busy. Can you speed it up? Hey, I need to go. We need to take some time and really, to be honest with you, again, in my pastoring, uh, I've seen this happen a lot. People who are unwilling or don't feel like they're able to take the time uh, to seek God, uh, they think it's uh, too difficult or whatever, uh, they end up not hearing from God, they, they, can't, they do something themselves and then they get into more trouble. And I've even actually seen some people end up in the hospital where they have nothing to do but seek God. And even when they're there, they're watching TV all the time. So really, if we're gonna do this right, we need to just focus on it. So I wanna encourage you to do that. You can do it and God is gonna make sure that you get your breakthrough. Hey, I just wanted to remind you that during these 21 days of prayer and fasting, every Saturday at 9 a.m., every Sunday at 9.30 a.m., we're gonna be here at the church praying. So. We wanted to invite you to come and join us for this time of prayer.